this current test is using two foam rings. One for a bottom base that has no hole in it. And then right now, the second one that my small tank is currently sitting in is one that is made more like a donut. Uh, these are about two inch thick regular foam rings that I picked up at a craft or foam that I picked up at a craft store that I made the rings out of. Um, I'll probably make another one or two to utilize with the large tank. Currently, this test is running uh, two of my heavy duty fuse 35 millimeter reels, and this tank is filled all the way to the top with water. More of a kind of an overload test to see if it deforms the foam and causes any issues. You can see it's off slightly, but it hasn't moved. Um, it also helps that the base has some adjustments that you can move it from one side to the other to help balance it out as well. Um, but that's about it. So far it's actually looking pretty good here. Uh, backup plan would be to remove the uh, donut ring in here and just basically run it how it was before with the tank being rolled along as the uh, coffee can gets spun with the bottom solid piece of foam in there that at least moves my larger tank over the rim not enough to fall out but enough to be able to run along the rim to be be moved so that way then any excess water anything that's dripping out would fall onto say a container or into the sink instead so hopefully that helps <laughs>